Hey everybody, welcome back to Sci-Fi Fantasy with me, Kenny Conklin. Uh, doing a little work on the um, the Vorcha class, Vorcha class battle cruiser. Can't get that out for some reason. But been working on that, and of course I've been running into obstacles. I broke my teeny tiny one thirty second of an inch bits. I'm out of those, so I got to order more of those. I ruined a part. So I have to open my other kit and recast that part. I'm waiting on the supplies for that. But uh, let's bring you over and give you a little update of what's going on. Not with the wall, but with the build. So like last time you saw, <coughs> I had all that done. I started getting the windows cut out. I got this side done, most of this side over here, this side here, and I still got to do over here. Started uh, light blocking, and uh, this is pretty thin plastic, so uh, hopefully I don't make the mistake on this, which I won't. I'm going to have to, <coughs> excuse me, take my time on this side and only do a few windows at a time. Unfortunately, I got bored of doing all these little windows over here and I started on the bridge and I was making the shapes bigger this is all messed up because I was doing some stuff but I was making the shapes bigger because basically after I was done with the squares I was going to mask them off to size and then paint over now this <laughs> this got totally messed up this is uh sanded because I was going to sand it down, try to clean it up, but what I use, I don't use the dental acrylic, I use, as you guys seen before, the uh, the nail polymer with the uh, the setting solution for this stuff here. Just send this, well, because I was in a rush and I didn't want to take my time with this, what I did was, I, yeah, can't get enough light in there. What I did was taped off the front, the whole front, instead of doing a couple windows and set it in there, a couple windows and set it in there, I decided I was going to tape off the whole front, put the powder in everything, and put a ton of setting solution in here. Very bad idea. Uh, with When I was doing the Voyager in the windows, no problems. The plastic is actually thicker on that than this. This is pretty thin plastic, the, the kit itself. But anyway, what happened was once it was all dry, I peeled it off and the setting solution was still tacky up top on the details over here and I noticed that trying to wipe it off, the plastic was melting from, from this stuff over here. So <clears throat> my suggestion is do not do what I did. Take a couple windows at a time let them dry go on this way there's not an over usage of this and it's directly where you want it to be on your windows in here because this unfortunately melted it I don't know I, I know why because I goofed up and I was an idiot and wanted to rush things instead of just taking my time like I should and I mean it's no big deal because I have a second ship like this but if I didn't have a second ship I was kind of screwed where I would have to sand all this down, sand everything flush, look at pictures, and re-put re in all the detail on this guy. So until the uh, the stuff comes in to, to redo this, this is going to be on hold, and I'm waiting for drill bits to come in, so this is going to be on hold for a couple more days until until I can get all the stuff I need to start doing this. So that's a little bit of advice, guys. Don't go crazy with do a few windows. Once I get to this, I'll show you again. I'll do a few windows, just do it, put the solution in exactly where it's gotta be instead of trying to lump it on a whole place at one time. That was just not a not a bright idea by me. Um I think that's pretty much it on this guy for today. It's just a short update because like I said, I'm screwed because I have to wait for uh, parts to come in. We'll flip you around and there's my big head. So once these parts come in, we'll uh, 
we'll get going on this again. Uh, I heard from DLM, the parts are coming, they just had to be cast up so they'll be here soon so I could get back to work on my brother's Enterprise and uh, that'll take precedence over this guy so once I get those parts we'll be working full time on the Enterprise and this guy will take a back seat until, until that guy is done which, which will take a little bit because there's a lot, a lot of work that still has to be done on there. Um, other than that, just please be careful with the uh, the setting solutions on your plastic. Do a little bit at a time. Don't throw heaps and heaps of that stuff on there because the possibility you're gonna ruin a piece like I did. Uh, when I do get the the uh, molding stuff in to cast this, do the resin piece. We'll do a video on that too because it's my first time and watch me goof up and we'll see how I can mess up. <laughs> So, but thank you guys for watching. I know it's a short video, not much. I just want to show you the windows and, and what not to do. So, we shall see you soon. Hopefully, uh, stuff comes in tomorrow. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.